My name is Sebastian Kloborg. I'm a dancer with Goethe Dance. And uh, I am from Denmark, Copenhagen. I started dancing when I was 13. And then I moved on to join the Royal Danish Ballet for nine years in my hometown, Copenhagen. And uh, then I moved on to Stuttgart, where I joined the Goethe Dance Company of the Theater House there. Actually, both my parents are dancers. Um, and, and they were, of course, uh, asking me when I was smaller if, if I wanted to try and, and start dancing. But I don't know, I had to, to do my sports and the football and tennis and everything else. And then when I was 13, I, I, I felt like I, I wanted to try. So it was my own decision, which I'm also very happy about, that, that they, they didn't push me into anything, although they had the same background that I have now. When I was with the Royal Danish Ballet, the, the repertory, the, the choreographies we, we did were more classical. Uh, and also modern, but it was class it's a classical focused company. Um, and I enjoyed doing that very much, but also the more modern and contemporary works works being created for me as a dancer and and um, in the time we are living in now to see where dance is going to go. And, and that's what I enjoy being a part of now. We are 12 dancers now in Goche Dance. Uh, you can say it's a small company compared to uh, the Russian companies that have uh, 200 dancers, um, but I must say I enjoy being a smaller group. Uh, this uh, team spirit feeling, everybody's in the show, everybody has to pull it together and make it all work. Um, we travel together, we eat together, we, uh, I mean, we, we, are, we are one big family. It's, it's really, really nice. I'm 26 now, and uh, and two years ago I had a, a hernia in the back, a slip disc, uh, which set me out for, for almost a year. Um, and since then I've been been more aware of my age and how important it is to to um, to take care of yourself. Because when you're young, you go for it, and it's lovely, and you can still go for it when you're older. But you you learn. You, you know what your body needs to do before a show and what you need to do, where your mind has to be. And I can definitely feel I'm older, yes, but I try to, to act young. <laughs> Uh, of course, the show is, is the result of all our work, of all the hours in the studio where we're rehearsing without light, without costume, without sometimes live music. And we on, when we get on stage, we have to pull it all together. And of course, before a show, you focus and people focus in many different ways. Some have to be alone. I prefer to be with my, with my, with my, um, my colleagues and we play music and we have a good time and then we go warm up on stage before and then we focus on our own. But again, for me it's important to, to have the group feeling the whole way. And I know if, if they're there, then I have to be there for them. So it, that helps a lot for me. One can say that half is talent and half is hard work. It's not always like this um, in being a dancer, but uh, there are many different kinds of bodies, many kind, different kinds of minds, and you just have to find out where you fit in and. Also, the more experience you get from one company will make you, it makes a clearer picture of who you are as a dancer. And once you know who you are, then I feel you can really start enjoying dancing. I'm, I'm very fortunate. I've been many places to perform all over the world and, and now I'm here in Luxembourg and I'm really, really happy to be here. Um, and that's also why I chose Goethe Dance because they really, they are lucky to be uh, all over the world. Mm -hmm. 